Hey y'all, I just passed the 427 data management application version 3 on my first try, so I figured I'd drop a few tips. Um, I've got some basic SQL knowledge, but I know this course can be a headache for a lot of people. What helped me was taking the pre-assessment three times. As you can see here, I took it until I can, until I could write the syntax for memory without notes. And also for anything I wasn't super confident in, I'll... I use ChatGPT to walk me through it and explaining it in a ways that makes sense. Um, since this is a newer version of the course, the assessment is extremely buggy. So there were a couple questions that for some reason I kept getting it wrong and I just left it as is. But for anyone that's taking this course, if you're taking version three, there's a reference sheet, which is extremely helpful and I definitely use that a couple times. And also, if you're looking for like basic SQL commands, W3School is a good resource to use. And I'm not sure about the older version, but for this one, there's a PowerPoint that I got. I don't remember where I got it, but I think you can find it in the course material. But this PowerPoint here is extremely helpful because there's a couple questions that it's gonna ask you about joins and aggregate functions. And you definitely wanna know the difference between those two and when to use them. So as you can see here, I took, like I said, I took the pre-assessment three times until it clicks. And then I schedule my test the same day, which obviously I pass. So for anyone that's taking this course, hopefully these tips and tricks help. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out and I'll help in any way that I can. So that's it for today and I'll see you guys next time.